study done by a colleague of mine, Dr. Laurence Zitvogel, she looked at 249 cancer patients who were receiving immune therapies and separated them into people who responded versus people who did not respond. And what she found was that the difference between people who responded and didn't respond was one bacteria. Unbelievable. Acromancia, right? Yeah. So, well, isn't that easy? You can just maybe take some probiotics with acromancia, except that you can't. No. There's no acromancia probiotic. But you can feed them. But you can feed it. And you can actually change your gut to make your body grow acromancia. And the way to do this is the food as medicine solution. So it turns out that pomegranates and cranberries actually have elagitanins, pomegranates especially, and that natural chemical in pomegranate juice. And what's been shown is that just one eight ounce cup of real pomegranate juice, not the flavored stuff, but the real stuff over the course of a week or two will actually help change the inside of our guts so that that bacteria likes to grow. That bacteria grows in the lining of the gut, talks to the immune system, and that makes the cancer immunotherapy work better. Yeah, and, then, and there's other things too, like, like you said, cranberries and and green tea. Many things can actually feed our microbiome, right? So yeah. plant-based foods, have, you know, I think it's completely accepted now. It's not a challenge that plant-based nutrition is actually the healthy approach to life.